If you demand nothing, you are taken by your word, and you will get exactly that. What is it? What is it? Nothing. Nothing. And I don't want it to happen. And this is why I want you to get some little insights and why am I here to give you some insights. We can start, go to the next slide. Um, because I want you to, make, to really get the salary and career you deserve. And it's my mission to help you earn your worth, to support you in your price and salary negotiations, to also support you on your way to a successful career and make sure that you can stay authentic and don't have to be the superstar negotiations. And I also and I also help companies on their on their way to become an employer of choice because I help them to really establish fair and equal pay schemes because eventually I don't want you to have to negotiate your salary. I think a really fair company does not put you through this ordeal. And until we are there, I will give you some tips. So let's get started. What will be your takeaways today? Um, I will, let, let's skip my presentation. I can tell you afterwards. Um, what will be your takeaways? Next slide and then we go back. Um, your takeaways will be value times four. I want you to leave this room and remember value times four. Why? Because if you negotiate your career or your salary, you should be fully aware about your market value, the added value you can bring to the new employer or to the existing company. You should know about your self-value and you should be well prepared because there is really a value to a good preparation because then you will get the salary and career you deserve. So let's get back one slide, please. Because, uh, two slides, please. Today I'm a bit too. Um, so this makes it a bit more lively. <laughs> Otherwise I get bored. So who am I? Why do I talk about these topics? I'm the founder of Salary Negotiations, Fair and Equal Pay and Colorful Career, three training and consulting companies. And before that, I was the head of HR of Erste Bank, Austria. And before I was a managing director in a service industry in Central Southeastern Europe, and I was, was also the head of the supervisory board. So why do I tell you? I just simply tell you because when I look at salary negotiations, I look at it from both sides, from the HR side, as well as from the side of a manager. And of course, I was an employee my whole life, so I look at it from this side as well. So when I give you some recommendations, I try to really consider all these different perspectives. And other than that, I'm a, a, I'm a, a consulting and career partner at the VU Executive Academy. This is the business school of the Vienna University of Economics. And I run a course in people and culture management for them. So that's all to me. And now I want you, I want you to think about what is the most important, or what are the most important factors for a successful salary negotiation. We will, you, you can just put your phone on the screen and then we have to, we wait a little bit and then we move to the... Uh, 